what's up everybody, it's Jeremiah with Bullfrog Air Guns. I'm here today to talk about this little compressor. It's made by GX and it is powered by an 18 volt lithium battery. Um, this is the battery that comes with it. It says right on there, GX pump, high pressure compressor, 18 volt max lithium battery. So it's not a knockoff battery. This battery does go to this compressor. However, the convenient thing is, is that the Makita batteries also fit it. So I happen to have a lot of Makita tools and uh, about 15 of these Makita batteries. So that's pretty convenient for me. Um, when I first got this, I wasn't expecting a whole lot out of it. I mean, considering how little it is, there's no water, there's no oil. It's got these two little fans. Um, I really wasn't expecting much. And so I, when you get the instructions, it tells you to uh, close the, to, first of all, it has the stop right here to block it. And so it tells you to leave that in, turn the compressor on, and once it gets running, close the bleed valve and then time how long it takes to get to 30 MPA and that's how you can gauge uh, the working order of the compressor so after a week of use I'll check that again and see if it um, is still the same time it was about 28 seconds so uh, to fully pressurize and so in about a week after use I'll check that again and I will be doing a review on this after using it um, pretty heavily. Um, there is a little filter up here for the air intake and in here there's a little filter pretty much you know small version of the hings but there's one on the intake and uh, and on the whip. Uh, it also comes with some extra burst discs and a gasket and so um, I have the Makita battery hooked up to it right now. Um, when I filled the Marauder, it took uh, 2 minutes and 42 seconds to fill from 2,000 PSI up to um, 3,000. So right now, I'm going to fill my Air Force Condor, which is also down to... It's right at 2,000 PSI. So, let's see how long this takes to fill it up. Take the stop out. Now I'm going to turn the compressor on and it takes a second for the little fans to kick on and start going. But they'll kick on and then I'll close off the bleed valve. And obviously when it fills up, I'll release the bleed valve before I turn off the compressor. Um, yeah, so here we go. Okay, so I didn't time that with my phone, but through the editing, it took this long to fill from 2,000 PSI to 3,000 PSI on my Air Force Condor. So it's obviously not as fast as the uh, Chinese compressor that we're all used to, the Hing. So, but there's no oil, there's no water, it's very small, very compact, um, 
you can touch it and not burn yourself. I mean, after running that long, it's not hot anywhere. So, I mean, it's, it's warm, but you're not burning yourself like on the pipes on my other one. And, you know, you don't have to go to your car to hook this up to the battery and, you know, fill. It's pretty convenient. I'm pretty impressed with it. I did not expect to uh, be this impressed with it, you know. And so, so far, I filled my Benjamin Marauder from 2000 to 3000. I shot, uh, I filled my uh, Gauntlet from 2000 to 3000. And then I just filled my Condor from 2000 to 3000. That Makita battery, which is a 5.0 amp hours, it only used half my battery to top off three guns. Now, the battery that comes with it is a 7.8 amp hour. I think that's what the AH stands for. Ampage hour or something like that. But anyways, my 5.0 is only halfway down. So that's pretty convenient. That gives you quite a bit of... Uh, shooting and being able to top off with just one battery that it comes with. Um, if you use Makita like I do and have 15 batteries, um, then this thing's really convenient because I can be out all day long and not run out of my batteries. So um, this is awesome. I'm now portable. I was not portable before. Uh, I mainly just shoot at home anyhow. Um, I want to get out and shoot some of the areas around here and get into some uh, predator hunting and whatnot. And so uh, this makes it pretty convenient. Yes, yeah, so um, I will put the link in the bio for this. This is the GX 18 volt uh, compressor. So go ahead and check that out. And uh, go ahead, like, subscribe, and share. And I'll see you guys on the next one.